I literally cried to see my mom and my aunt. Certainly tears of joy for Carolyn Slay, seeing a part of her in a picture 18 feet in height on the city's old waterworks building. It is my history, my legacy, what I can give back to this community and my children and grandkids. I think it's really important for people to be able to see themselves and their families and their communities reflected in the history um, and be able to connect to it. It's a connection for many and an introduction for others, an intro to the history of that neighborhood and beyond. People that have never lived in Savannah can see what it was in the 40s and 50s. Growing up here in Cava Village, this building was a structure of men working where they started their day. Certainly a bustling area at the Savannah Waterworks Pump House at the corner of Gwinnett and Stiles, built in the late 1800s, supplying the city of Savannah with water for nearly five decades. Now these photographs that are placed all around this building, which was added this year, to the National Register of Historic Places, those pictures I mentioned tell a story themselves. It's history. It was taken before I was born, so I'm able to reflect on the younger life of both women. But there's more information behind those images, right? So we want people who want to know more to be able to get all that information. So we have a partner online exhibit where you can go and you can learn about who is in those images, everything that we have. For some images, some, some of them are unidentified individuals. Um, but if you want to know um, where the, what collection those images are, are from, who's in those images if they're identified, you can get all that in information off of the online version. Or if you know you can't get down there, or you know you want to share it with you know your family member who's moved away from Savannah, you're like, oh my gosh, my great grandfather's on the building. I want you to see that. Then you can send them the link to the online version. When we leave a part of the history here, we have something to reflect from where we came from to where we are going presently. And the new arena gives us that. Which is just to the north of the historic Waterworks building, bringing into balance the past and the present. For SGTV's CitySpan, I'm Ken Slats.